You try to help me now, man? Mission four, vent your anger and destroy the TV. Die! Sonic Boom! Every goddamn screen looks the same. I can't tell where I am or where I'm going with this shit. And the cabins? Just fucking horrible. I can't find the fucking fireplaces. I get lost once I'm inside. I can't even just simply turn around and see the door. The control's so fucking awkward. I'd rather play Doom on Atari. I'd rather play Halo on a Tiger Electronic Wrist game. I'd rather drown in diarrhea. I'd rather fucking eat my fucking balls off and puke them up my fucking ass. I'd rather piss a cactus out of my dick. The music is fucking worse than life itself, and I turn the volume down except for the fact that I have to hear the Jason alarm. It's all just a test of patience, and it can kiss my fucking asshole. <laughs> You're easier to beat in real life than you are in that fucking game, you no good piece of This game is fucking horrible! Oh, oh. Alright. Okay, let's play this bitch. You filthy animal, you miserable fucking cunt, you piece of shit! Shitty games, all my life! Shitty fucking games! I hate shitty fucking games, and I hate shitty fucking Christmas, cause shitty fucking Christmas means more shitty fucking games! Humbug! Bah! Fucking humbug at the hell! I'm gonna shove these fucking games off your ass! Batman Revenge the Joker! Oh. Batman Return of the Joker! Oh. Batman Forever! Oh. Batman Return of the Joker on Game Boy! Oh. And last but not least, Batman on Commodore 64! Oh. 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 Fuck! 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 Could they have put this clue in a more unreachable spot? What? I got it? And you know, I really wanted to give it a chance because I kind of liked the idea of finding clues and figuring out where to go like it made you think like a detective. But one guy, no continues? Like seriously, give me a reason why there's no continues. Why are there no continues? Why are there no fucking continues? Why? Ah! <laughs> all it is is just rats and bats. How many fucking games need to have bats? Like seriously, I know it's Dracula, but why do so many games have so many fucking bats? Seriously, I fucking hate bats. <laughs> <laughs> When you kill him, you get these amusing cutscenes. You've killed me! Good. Good. <laughs> you killed me! Good! <laughs> fuck! 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 Gotta calm down. Oh, 
Okay, zero lives. That means I have one more chance. Jump. 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 Oh, fuck. <laughs> Too fucking small. Too fucking small. <laughs> You're terminated. Bombs, huh? Well, bombs away, you woody, funny, fucking pecker piece of shit! Why couldn't I have those games when I was a kid? God damn it, I was born too fucking early. <sighs> Instead, I have to grow up with these miserable pieces of shit fucking anal jugs. These games suck Baragon sweaty ball sack. I'd rather get an electric shock from sucking Mechagodzilla's mechanical wiener. These games are shit drizzling out of the smog monster's rancid putrid a-hole. And then being swallowed and barfed up by Angerus while I lay on his spikes getting Gigan's buzzsaw up my ass. While Desodroya dumps his diabolical diarrhea all over my face. Man, it's just a bunch of fuck. It's a pile of cunt. Fuck. Shit. Fuck. Cunt. Fuck. God damn it. I just said fuck from the bottom of my heart and I said every curse that there is. There's nothing left. So you know what? Somebody's got to invent a new curse word. I think I got it. This game, these fucking games are... Oh yeah. It's that bad. In this stage, the key doesn't appear until you buy an invincibility potion and three slingshots. How would anybody know to do that? You go through the whole game, all of a sudden they throw you a curveball and change the fucking rules. Imagine if in Super Mario Brothers, if one level, you can't jump on the flagpole at the end. Unless first you collect exactly 29 coins, stomp three Goombas, and get a fire flower. You wanna know how I feel now? I'm fucking enraged! You don't just change the rules like that! This is shit sauce! This is Dr. Jekyll and Mr. Hyde standards! And I'm still playing it. I don't even know why. I guess I can't resist being able to say I beat Little Red Hood. And you know what? I don't expect a good ending either. Why work hard on creating an elaborate ending when you've made the game so hard to figure out that there's not a chance in hell anyone would get that far? In fact, I expect a shitty ending. A fucking loathsome, ass-sucking shit heap of an ending! Oh, my dear little Red Hood, thank you for your coming. You did not disappoint. This is a blizzard of balls! I can't believe humanity was capable of degrading itself so low as to produce such an insulting catastrophe of ass! Do not store in extreme temperatures. Do not immerse in water. Do not clean with benzene, thinner alcohol, or other such solvents. Do not hit or drop cartridge. Do not attempt to disassemble. Like that.
that. Burn, motherfucker, burn! In spite of its simplicity, it's a fun and addicting game, even to this day. I thought it was fun. Apparently people thought so too, back then. That's why they made a home Pong console. So you can play it at home. And then, there is another one. And 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 another one. There was like nine million fucking Pong consoles. These things come from hell. These forks at the end might as well be the devil's pitchfork. One of them's chewed off, so I have no way of connecting it to the TV. And I have no way of replacing the box! You think that makes me happy? <laughs> it doesn't. They spend all their focus on this one game. So this one's gotta be good. Right? It sucks monkey butts like all the fucking rest! Okay, let's go. Governor Tarkin versus Count Duke. Oh my God! Shit through my fucking window! Oh my fucking god, there's shit and fucking glass all over the place! Where the fuck did that come from? Oh my god, I gotta clean all this shit up! What the fuck, man? What the fuck? You know what? You be the first player. Yeah, let's see how you like it. Yeah, ain't that fun? How you like that? Robo fuck is my piece of shit! I won't fucking have it! on a really high difficulty setting. Yeah, let me see what I could do here. Um, easy? It was on easy? That's their idea of fucking easy? Are they out of their minds? All right, let's flick that shit switch and crank up that diarrhea dial. I got Dark Castle on C, D, I. The Genesis version was bad, but this one fucks you harder than life itself. It's like mixing shit with turds. It's the most heinously anus thing ever conceived by humankind. It's a curse to the soul, and it must suffer the tortures of the damned. I remember my first time playing it as a kid. It was a Friday night. My homework was all done. My mom took me to the video store. I read this game. I took it home, man. I played it, and it just fucking pissed me off and ruined my whole goddamn weekend! Fuck! Alright, come on. Come on, come on, come on. Oops. I hit start. I hit start. 
I gotta go all the way back to the beginning. I'm seeing red. I'm gonna beat this fucker right now. What is it with football? Everywhere you go, football. Go there, football. Football, football, football. Look what the fuck? Sunday football. Monday night football. Thursday football. Football on Thanksgiving. Football on Christmas. And out of all sports, it's the one everybody goes the most fucking ape shit over. Makes them act like fucking maniacs. <laughs> <laughs> when sports games were fucking sports games. Look at these titles. Baseball, basketball, football. Not this Madden shit. Just plain ass, normal, every day, no question about it. No NFL, no year. Not named after a player, not named after a coach, not named after the referees, pet goldfish. No quarterback, dimeback, nickelback. Simple, ordinary, unembellished, unmistakable, crystal clear, as frank as Frankenstein, as blunt as an atom bomb. One compound word. It's motherfucking goddamn sons of bitchin' fuck fuck. Fucking football! <laughs> Touchdown! <laughs> this game is diarrhea coming out of an old woman's bleeding vagina! It's fucking terrible! What were they thinking? I know. They weren't thinking. Wow. Look at how badass this game is. Yeah, this is the hot shit right here. You'd be so cool going around wearing this thing. Yeah, you'd be walking around school and you got this on and everybody else is talking about what the new hot game system is gonna be. <laughs> Nintendo 64, the Bit Wars. <laughs> 64 bits, 32 bits, 16 bits. 8 bits, 4 bits, 2 bits, 1 bit, half bit, quarter bit, THE WRIST GAME! Who made this game? Hi. Oh my god, they did it, they pulled through, oh my god, they made a game, it's not a steaming pile of fucking shit, oh my god, they did it, they made a game, that's not shit, I found the gold. at the end of the rainbow, oh maybe it's not gold, maybe it's bronze or something, but they made a game! It's not shit! It's not shit! So I bet this could be great. Unless... Oh, come on! Why? 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 Of course. It was made by LJN. Well, fuck this game. Watch it go. Uh, Beetlejuice, Beetlejuice, Beetlejuice! It's showtime! Uh, uh, I've seen The Exorcist 167 times. It keeps getting funny every fucking time. Uh, Happy Halloween, motherfucker! Uh, uh, uh. Crazy bus, man! Don't forget it. Say it. One word, not crazy bus. It's crazy bus, and it's fucking crazy. Whoa! We're driving a bus here. It's fucking crazy. Oh my god! It, I can't take it. It's so fucking crazy. Crazy bus! Crazy bus! Crazy bus! Whoa! <laughs> the driver fell asleep on the wheel. Well, only one more present left. You wanna take a peek? Yeah, let's take a peek.
Okay, so Bruce Lee is in the background, the guy at the podium is Chris Patton, former governor of Hong Kong, and over there is Jackie Chan. Which one is Chin? For the massacre of the Reds. Chin is a killer machine. That's Chin? <laughs> it's Jackie Chan playing Bruce Lee's relative <laughs> Chin. Oh, Chin. What a name. Could it be any more common? Oh, wipe out all 1.2 billion of the Red Communists. <laughs> Stop. I can't, I can't take anymore. I haven't even seen the game yet. Oh, oh, oh. wipe out 1.2 billion people. And if I'm not mistaken, in 1995, that would have been the entire population of China. Bruce Lee's relative is so powerful, he's the equivalent of a thousand nukes. He's gonna murder the entire population of China by breaking their necks. Even when Bruce Lee would take down 20 people, it took him a little bit of time. But now comes Chin. You don't fuck with Chin. However, in mainland China, there was a secret project in progress. A project to, tra tra to transform the deceased Tong Xiaoping into an alternate... <laughs> it's killing me. Let's try again. Wait for it. N nope. Not now. Next time. And here it comes. Stand still for too long, a safe drops on you. Like the game is saying, fuck you. Might as well just be a giant middle finger, and it should be the only part of the game in 3D. Put on your 3D glasses, get ready, set, fuck you, kids. So what do you do in this game? Well, the instructions say, you're free to enjoy semen. Oh, no, 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 no! It's sea man Sea man Not semen. As in jizz, splooge, man bazooka juice. Let's check it out. No. No way. It's an official Famicom disc game that says the F word. And this was in the 80s. This was before Hong Kong 97. It's an officially released game on a Nintendo console that says fuck. Oh my god, my life is complete! It says fuck! It says fuck! Oh, oh, I forgot about Seaman! No wonder I haven't played this one before! This is anal sauce! Finish him. Fatality. Let's pop this fucker in here. Health almost gone? Fuck! I am the great Cornholio! I need TP for my bunghole! Just to think, 
all the hours spent, all that time, all that torture, and now it's all over? I'm really sorry, nerd. I thought you would have loved a game that was ass. And why would I love that? Because you're a piece of shit. <laughs> no! Hey, you're not talking now, Charlie!